Hello, I am Shubhankar, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Bengaluru. Today I am going to show you how to optimize storage consumption in your Amazon Relational Database service for Microsoft SQL Server DB instance. Let's get started. First, let's check if your RDS instance is in the storage full state. To do this, we will sign in to the AWS Management Console and open the RDS Console. Choose your DB instance and check the status field. If the field displays storage full, then basic operations are blocked until you add more storage capacity. You can also monitor the free storage space metric in Amazon CloudWatch to track available storage space for your DB instance. Let's look at ways to optimize if your instance isn't in the storage full state. The first step is to understand how SQL Server uses the allocated storage. Open a new SQL query window and run the following query to get the details on the database file usage. The query results show the database files including data, rows, indexes and logs. To check the current size of TemDB, run this query. The TemDB grows automatically and can consume significant storage. To get breakdown of total storage used by each database, run this query. To review the amount of storage used by transaction logs, run this query. You might be able to reclaim space from logs by using dbcc shrink file. You can also check database indexes, trace files, Amazon S3 integration files, change data capture logs and audit logs. If you have exhausted all options to reclaim storage, you can scale up by modifying the allocated storage through Amazon RDS console or AWS command line interface. So now you know how to optimize storage consumption in your Amazon RDS for Microsoft SQL Server DB instance. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.